Hello Vinyl Community, Frank here aka Mr. 666 Calls. Today we are Monday morning and well it's almost lunch time and I am, yes, I'm drinking a good bottle of wine and I have a very good reason for today. This is, uh, as you guys can see, it's a 2004 Chateau Saint Didier Parnac with a, in a I'm gonna pour myself a little glass and tell you a little bit of what just happened to me last week. Uh, last Sunday I'm at my record store and I'm working and I just get a phone call. You know? So I answer the phone and the lady tells me, do you buy uh, record collections? I said, look, it depends what it is. I, mean, I don't usually sell used records but you know I'm a collector it depends what you have she goes look uh, my f grandfather passed away and I inherited his uh, uh, music collection she goes how many records do you have she goes I have 950 vinyls about a thousand CDs and 2,000 uh, cassettes I go okay look this is too big I can't you know it's like first of all I don't even have a tape deck so the cassettes we rule them out but vinyls I collect vinyls, I probably would buy them for my private collection, look, but I'm telling you, I don't have a lot of money, is, um, uh, you know, I have a record store, I'm renovating, I'm moving the store, this and that, so I don't have a lot of money to spend, Should I go, I have maybe $500, maybe even less, you know, to spend, she goes, so look, don't worry, I'm gonna call my sister-in-law, I'll send you the list, and I'll call you back to say if she's okay with it. So I hang up the phone, you know, wait for the email, she sends me the email, I start looking and she calls me back not even five minutes after and she, uh, she says, okay, next Monday you can come and pick it up. So I'm gonna show you guys what I got. As you guys know, I didn't have a lot of jazz. Sorry, cause I just took a sip of the wine. I didn't have a lot of jazz records, so what I... I said, okay, so I'll go pick them up. Why not, you know? And I, if you guys add it up, the, these records came to 47 cents Canadian. So I'm gonna show you what I picked up. And they all even came in plastic crates. So this is what I got. And I just went through the boxes because I just got home, you know, like uh, I have ECM, there's Verve, Blue Note, Conquer, records it's like impulse i have all kind of labels here and they're all in near mint condition the sleeves are from very good to near mint and uh, so i have maybe half a dozen of those records that are signed by the artists i know there's a uh, oliver jones there's oscar peterson steve wallace and reg swagger some that i have signed as you guys can see all the boxes here and I opened box number eight and what do I find I find 12 mosaic vinyl records out of print sold out box sets some of them contain up to 12 records and I paid 47 cents for each box set which is just I'm still in heaven, you know, like I can't believe it. This is Christmas, you know, in the month of August. And the lady was nice enough to tell me that she would even throw in all those cassettes. She gave it to me for free. In those all cases, as you can see, I still, you know, like I have to pinch myself because I think it's not true. This is a double case. The bottom opens up if I turn it over and then it opens up and this here and I told her look if you uh, if you want the CDs I'll probably go and pick them up look I'm gonna show you my music room well uh, which is my living room also this is part of my collection here some of the vinyl records this is my good friend the big uh, bull skull which is going to my store some of my CDs and this is my record shelves which are almost empty but I probably have to buy now a new unit for it and to let you guys know I only start 
buying records from last January. So which is I think is a pretty good start for a eight month that I'm into record collecting back again. So and this is all thanks to you guys on the vinyl community. So guys, if you guys don't mind, this is actually what you guys are listening to in the background. It's a John Fattis Young Blood. It's on Pablo Records. And guys, sorry, you guys even saw my bathroom. I'm gonna post this and hope you guys enjoy and leave some comments. They're always appreciated. Man, this is my sound system. This is our Mirage speakers. This is my TV set. And as you can see, it's just a little new mark turntable. You know, it's like a, I'm not an audiophile nut. So as long as the records play good and it sounds good, I'm a happy man. And I am a very happy man with all these records again, guys. I'm gonna go look through the boxes because I even I just went through the first one fast fast to see which labels that I had in there so and as you guys guessed I will do uh, dozens of videos to show you what I listened to and what I got okay hope you guys enjoy see ya and keep the vinyl spinning